there is one flawed code feature that most people aren't using, but it's so powerful, I'm making an entire video on it. I'm talking about skills. Think of it like making a standard operating procedure. You show Claude how to do something step by step and save that as a skill. It's not just about building one skill though. I find daisy chaining multiple skills together makes them even more powerful. I'm going to show you what I mean using a simple example. How I researched and recorded this YouTube video. The same principles apply whether you're coding or marketing or anything else. By the end, you'll understand how to build skill chains for your workflow. Let's get started. So my YouTube script writing process starts by researching other videos. This particular video is a combination of this one, this one, this one, this one, and this one. But how do I get all of that knowledge from YouTube into my cloud thread? I've got a skill for it. This is my YouTube transcript fetcher skill. Okay. It's a little Python script that basically I give it a URL and it fetches the transcript. I didn't write this code. I asked Claude to make this. Now, how do I use this skill? I just shared the links of all YouTube videos I want to get in my context and the link to the skill. I was like, use this skill to fetch all these transcripts. It got a bit confused in invoking Python on my computer, but then it got steady. So then I've got all the five transcripts in my folder. The next step is I just asked it to read it. Now it reads and I've got a Claude thread wound up with all of this context. Then I can start with, I'd like to make a YouTube video on my angle or tip or how to use Claude code skill. Then I go, I'd like to make a YouTube video on whatever topic like this one that I'm working on. But it doesn't just stop there. The daisy chain continues because I've got a script write a skill and then I've got a YouTube packaging expert skill which has things around thumbnail psychology and other viral examples. Then I've got a LinkedIn post writer skill and then an email newsletter writer skill. Now there's no copy pasting prompts or trying to use different agents that don't have enough context. In this Claude thread I've got my expert YouTube video context, then I've got my script context, then I've got the packaging context, and in the same context, the LinkedIn and email newsletter. If you use agents in Claude, they spin up new clean threads, they don't have any context, no memory of what it is, and you have to build their context again. I actually had agents. So I had the email newsletter agent, I had the LinkedIn post agent, I had these agents as well. And at the beginning of these agents, I would be like, okay, read the whole transcript, read the whole intro text, read this, read the voice guide, then start doing it. It would have to build this entire context. And that's one of the big advantages between skills versus agents. You can load them into your exact same thread and keep the context consistent while you're working on one particular task. Now, how do you make a skill yourself? It's very easy. Before I continue further, I just like to mention that I run the AI First School community where more than a hundred of us hang out and discuss AI first workflows for making apps or why marketing or all things AI. I'll see you in the community. Entropic has this public skills repository and one of the skills in there is the skill creator skill. So all I had to do was slash plugin marketplace add Entropic skills. Just copy paste this plugin command into your cloud thread like this. I've already got it installed, so it's going to give me an error. And the next step is to install the plugin. We're looking for the example skills plugin. So copy and paste this one. Again, I've already got it installed, so it's not showing me the success message. But after that, once you're done with a particular cloud thread and you want to save the SOP, you can just say, use the skill creator skill to write a skill for this. That's all. Let me show you live. So a while back, I had to do a couple of landing page audits. Now I can start new threads and do new landing page audits and Claude in general is good at landing page audits. But if you give it a bit more of a resource or a checklist, it functions better. So I found this resource online. I can just copy paste all of its content into a Claude thread. Once I've pasted the entire piece of content here, I can just ask, use the skill creator skill to make a landing page auditor. And that is enough. See what it says. I'll use the skill creator skill to make the landing page auditor based on the comprehensive checklist. So it's the example skill, skill creator, the one we got from the Anthropic Marketplace. I'm like, yes, don't ask again. And then the skill is loading into the context. The knowledge has loaded into the context and it will just start executing and making the skill. So there you have it. Daisy chain those skills over time and you can 10x your workflow. If you've got any questions, drop a comment below. I post weekly about AI first workflows. Do subscribe to the channel to stay up to date. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks. Bye.